Hi, I'm Peter from GardenWorks and today I'm going to talk about growing your own garlic. It tastes absolutely amazing when it's taken straight from your own garden. There are so many great varieties to choose from and don't just stick to the regular garlic that you can get in the supermarkets. Try Dugansky, Chesnok, all there's so many different great varieties. Russian red is also a wonderful tasting garlic. Um, all you need is a sunny space. You don't have to plant them directly into the garden, you can also use a container. If you're going to be growing garlic in a container, start off with a good potting soil. GardenWorks Planter Box Mix is excellent. In a container, just like in the garden, add some bone meal or bulb food. It gets the roots growing really well. Generous helping. And turn it in. Your bulb is divided into about five or six cloves. The top of the bulb is, the hard neck of the bulb is the top of the bulb, and you want to be dividing it up. First of all, break the shield, this um, hard layer that you have over the bottom. You have the skin on the outside. Just break it up slightly. So you just divide it up into cloves. Nice big fat cloves on this one. It's really good. Some of them will be smaller, some of them will be bigger. Don't worry about that. Choose the healthiest ones. You don't need to worry about taking the skin off too much. That is the top of the bulb. Now you've got five. You want to space them nice and evenly. Evenly. This is actually just perfect for this size of pot. That's the spacing you're going to have. And you just press them into the soil. A few inches down is all you need to do. Cover over. And water. And your job is done. Your garlic is planted. All you need to do now is wait. You may see the little noses sticking up through the winter. Don't worry about that. All the garlic is doing is forming roots and they may sprout a little bit above the soil. That's not a problem. You will have a beautiful plant sprouting up in the spring and you'll be harvesting fresh garlic from your garden in about August next year.